give a fuck. I don't give a fuck. I don't, I don't, I don't give a fuck, bitch. Oh, this isn't my room. Hmm. Winner undeclared in local contest. The Annabelle Grill Letty's arm wrestling tournament is over and the judge missed it. Read the four statements and help him determine the... Oh, God. What? Well, it's like, who's who, though? Like, I want to say she's the winner, but I don't know. Like, I honestly do not know. Who the first two contestants were it was like these two, but I'm gonna go with her. Come on! Oh yes! I didn't need a hit. That was a tricky one. That yeah, was. Whoa, what's this? Someone left a screwdriver in the alley beside the hotel. Looks clean. Probably of no consequence. Can I take it? Someone left a sc looks clean. Are you serious? No. that she said there hasn't been gum like a couple months and yet that wasn't there when I left so help wanted I hear that shop recently hired the local high school football team the whole team yeah hmm what oh okay the varsity muskrats got after-school jobs at Hank's window shop, but they can't skip football practice. Help them complete the pass without breaking any glass. Oh god, no. 
It's not one to do. Well, it's like the only way. Maybe I start there. Okay, so go that way, that way. Ah, okay, hold on. I'm dumb. And then, okay, so this way, this way. This way, this way. Don't do it that way. Go down. Up. Down. Okay. That should be it. Well, that takes care of that one. Does it really though? Do you want to talk Excuse again? Excuse me, Bjorn. Foreman. Do you know anything about Isaac Davner's accident at the factory? Some think it wasn't an Isaac. accident. But he should have known better. Known what? Sir? Hmm. Okay. Maybe I can talk to the other guy again. The crazy dude. I wanted to ask her about the guy outside. Got any more puzzles you need help with? Puzzles. No new puzzles yet. Brain's always thinking. Thinking about puzzles. I'll just check in on you later. Maybe your brain needs to take a little break, bud. Okay, now we can go to the... place. I'm fine with that. Uh, eraser factory. Maybe it's called Argo. Is it called Argo? I think it's called Argo. Oh, you betcha, yeah. Yeah. Okay. Oh. Ooh, what this? Hmm, interesting. Out at their eraser factory. The doors to the factory are very locked. Some sort of custom-built contraption has yeah. got this place locked up tighter than Fort Knox. The device seems damaged, though. It seems to be missing, missing a piece. Yep. Okay, let's talk to this guy. Hi, Sheriff Bob. Yeah, I'm uh, Nelson Tethers of the FBI's Department of Puzzle... Agent Tethers, good to meet you. We got <laughs> a real mess here. Yes, we do. We do? Oh, yes. It's going to be a while before we can get this factory running again. But my job is to get this factory back to making erasers. Agent Tethers, you're in a right pickle. Well, I should probably ask you some questions about the incident then. That's what I'd do if I was a big, important FBI boy. Uh, you want to chill out? I don't give a fuck, I don't give a fuck, I don't, I don't, I What was this incident? Well, we don't need to be dramatic. What happened? There was an explosion. What? Oh, yeah. Don't need a to be dramatic. Explosion. And the foreman just never came home. Is he dead? What? When did the accident take place? Well, I've been trying to figure that out myself. Here's what I know. Oh, fucking great. The SDZ Guard Service was employed to keep watch over the factory from midnight to midnight yesterday. From their statements, can you turn... Okay. Okay. Boom. One hour before the last shift started. I get the shortest shift. Three hours. Only Bernie put in the full eight hours. One hour before the last shift started. Worked from six until I was relieved. Worked from six. So she started working at six. 
only Bernie put in the full eight hours. Wasn't that what it makes sense? Hold on. One hour before the last ship to start it. Okay, so it says eight hours. Oh, so 24 hours. Okay, hold on. Okay, okay, I got you, I got you. Okay. Three hours. Worked from six till I was relieved. Only Bernie put in the full eight hours. So that would mean... 12, 8, that would be 4, right? Okay. So then one hour before the last shift started, before, so that'd be 3. Okay. Because I, I think Bernie and Al is the only ones that really. Pop looks so mad. <laughs> it's like, I cut short handed, motherfuckers. Okay, um. Iggy Iggy needs to go away. Um, so I'm guessing they all need to work eight hours. Oh wait, no, so then that's not true. Okay, okay, so three. Okay, so one, two, three. Worked from six till I was relieved. One, two, three. So maybe. I got the shortest shift, three hours. So then it would be... Six. Worked from six till I was relieved. Well, if you think about it, it would be eight hours. So she only worked until... Eight. I still think it would be three, because with the way they're talking about it, it doesn't matter that it was all like, because he's saying it was one hour before the last shift started, and it says that they work eight hours, so that would mean seven, eight, that would be 16 hours, and the last shift would have started at four. So, okay, let's try it. Please. <laughs> what? The big noise can only have occurred at one time, okay? But see, I don't know when she was relieved, okay? So it's like... Can I get a hint? Because I don't understand what's going on. Iggy started at 6, but did he start at 6 a.m. or 6 p.m.? Only one of these is possible given conditions. Iggy started at 6, okay. That still doesn't help me though. Like at all. Only Bernie put in the full 8 hours. Well then how- what did you put in? <laughs> shortest shift three hours. So it'd be three hours. Boom, one hour before the last shift started. So what if it's five? Was Iggy the last one? Oh shit. Otherwise it would be eight. Pop was last one. So let's try eight. I don't know. Honestly, like... It says Bernie put in the full eight hours. But it's like, boom, one hour before the last shift started. So then that would be one, two, three. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So that'd be four. I might have to use another 
another hint if this isn't right. Another hint because yes, more. Pop worked the last shift ending at midnight. Okay, so that means one hour before the last shift started. And Pop worked three hours, so it'd be eight, right? Oh man, that's. Weird. Please let this be it. Thank God. Borderline. It's okay, but it's okay. If there was an explosion at that time, wouldn't the icicles on the building have been knocked off? Hmm. Good point. Maybe they grew back. Maybe. What happened to the foreman? My notes don't have a lot of details. Well, we're still trying to figure that out. One day after work, Mr. Dabner just never came home. The accident was pretty bad. Oh, is there, uh, is there a body? No, nope. he's just gone. Isaac Dabner's his name, if you don't have that in your notes. We don't even know if he died in that explosion? Won't be able to find that out till we find a way into the factory. True. What did your investigation turn up? Not much. I can't figure out how to get past this lock. Well, that's because it's missing a piece. I can see that just by looking at it. So it is. I guess that's why you make the big bucks, right? That's right, sir. Okay. Well, I don't seem to be getting a lot of answers. Listen, why don't you meet me down at the Moose Ear Diner later? I have some files related to the case that you may be able to help me with. Oh, okay, but I really Agent think... Agent Tethers, it's a pleasure working with you. You're doing a great job. I'll meet you at the Moose Ear in a bit. Okay. I'm kind of jealous of his snowmobile. Hmm. I need to fix this door and get inside the factory. Okay. We'll figure that out later. First, let's uh, hang out with our buddy. Our new buddy. Well... What up? <laughs> okay. Not awkward at all. Give your all to me I give my all to you You're my end and my there seems to be some tiny footprints in the snow around the diner. But I don't see any kids around here. Possibilities include stealthy children, <laughs> tiny animals wearing boots, cats wearing shoes. Nice, Nelson. Now that's going in FBI records. And I'm still recording. Tether's out. You have a very unique way. Oh. Let's talk to him. Sign. Something wrong with your sign? Uh, I said, is there something wrong with... You a cop? I ain't got time for cops. I'm not a cop. Look, I gotta get this sign fixed before it gets dark. I don't want to be out here after dark, if you know what I mean. I don't, actually. 
What do you mean by that? It's just a fuse, but I can't remember which one it is. Not with all the oh, whispers in my head. What? Whispers? Get the fuse for me. I'm getting cold out here. The repairman has forgotten which fuse he needs to use, even though he coded them so he wouldn't forget. Select a fuse that completes the sequence. What? Oh, okay, um... I don't understand what this even means. Um... I want to say this one, but I don't know what, on what grounds that would be. Like, okay, because this one has a straight line, and it has a wiggly, this one has a straight line, this is a So I'm thinking this one has a wiggly, but it's like... I'll go with it? And if it's not right, I'll just go for it. Sequence of symbols on the fuse box looks somewhat familiar. Maybe it's not as random as it seems. That was the shittiest hint ever. It says they look familiar, but it's like, how do they look familiar? How? Tell me. Have a better hint. <laughs> Maybe it's this one? I honestly don't know what it's based on, but... We're just gonna go with it. This is what your tax dollars are paying for. <laughs> really? Retry. Oh my god. Yes, more, because you don't make any sense. Symbols on the fuses seem to be perfectly symmetrical. Kidding me, right? Like, these are all symmetrical. <laughs> that, these hints help nobody. Like, are you serious? This isn't it. Really? Really? Oh my god. So it has to be this one then, right? No, that's the one I chose. It has to be this one, my bad. I, I, still, I don't know why. I don't know how. Some reason that one's in. Cool. I guess. So what the fuck? Each figure in the sequence is made of a number and its mirror reflection joined together. Wow. Oh, that's so fucking dumb. Bitch, that should do it. Hey. What do you know? This ought to keep the little buggers away. Little what? Well, I gotta finish getting this sign mounted. See you later. Well, we'll see. Did you know Isaac Davner? Not much. Heard he had some kind of accident. Feel bad for his wife, Lori. Such a pretty girl. I should really talk to her. Do you know where I can find her? Yes, I do. Can I? So, where can I find her? Yeah. Inside. Oh. Okay, thank you. I don't suppose you know anything about the eraser factory accident? Don't suppose I do. Well, thank you, sir. Goodbye. To the bottom of this. Hey everybody. Got a staring problem, bitch.
Okay. 